Helicopters are remarkable aircraft, uniquely designed to take to the skies. Using rotating blades known as rotors, these rotors are the heart of a helicopter, generating the lift that allows it to soar, hover, and navigate through the air with agility. The design of helicopter rotor systems is crucial. It significantly impacts performance, maneuverability, and responsiveness to various flying conditions. But what are the different types of rotor systems? And how do they affect a helicopter's capabilities? In this video, we will explore the main types of helicopter rotor systems. Each type comes with its own set of advantages and specific uses. First, we have the single rotor system. This is the most common configuration, featuring one main rotor and a tail rotor to counteract torque. It's efficient and simple, making it ideal for various missions. This design is prevalent in most conventional helicopters, including iconic models such as the Bell 206 and the Robinson R-22. The simplicity of the single rotor system not only reduces mechanical complexity, but also enhances efficiency. As a result, it is favored for a variety of applications, including aerial tours, law enforcement, and emergency medical services, where reliability and straightforward operation are paramount. Next, there's the tandem rotor system. Features two parallel rotors of equal size that rotate in opposite directions. This counter-rotation helps to cancel out the torque that each rotor would produce, resulting in a balanced and stable flight profile. This configuration is typically employed in heavy-lift helicopters, such as the CH-47 Chinook. The tandem design allows for an increased payload capacity and enhanced stability, making it particularly effective for transporting troops, equipment, and supplies in military operations, as well as for civilian applications like logging and construction, where heavy lifting is required. Then, we have the coaxial rotor system. Consists of two rotors mounted one above, the other on the same mast, rotating in opposite directions. This innovative design minimizes the need for a tail rotor, allowing for a more compact helicopter structure. Coaxial rotor systems can be found in helicopters, such as the Camov KA-50. This design offers several advantages, including enhanced lift capabilities, improved maneuverability, and better control in various flight conditions. These features make it particularly suitable for military applications, where agility and quick response times are crucial, as well as for specific civilian operations that require high performance in tight spaces. Another innovative design is the intermeshing rotor system where two rotors interlock, but without colliding. This unique configuration creates a highly efficient aerodynamic profile. This system is utilized in helicopters like the Come On K-Max, designed specifically for heavy lifting and aerial work. The intermeshing rotors provide remarkable stability and lift capabilities, making it particularly effective for operations in confined spaces, such as urban environments, or dense forests. It is ideal for missions that involve heavy external loads, including construction, firefighting, and disaster relief efforts. Transverse Rotor System has two parallel rotors that spin in opposite directions, improving lift and stability. This design enhances the aircraft's aerodynamic efficiency and maneuverability. A notable example of this system is the V-22 Osprey, a tiltrotor aircraft that merges helicopter vertical lift with the speed of a fixed-wing plane, allowing the Osprey to operate in tough environments like urban areas and remote locations. It can carry heavy loads and personnel, making it suitable for troop transport 
search and rescue, medical evacuation, and logistical support in military operations. Compound Rotor System Combines traditional rotor systems with fixed wings and other aerodynamic features. To enhance efficiency and speed, this hybrid approach allows for greater aerodynamic performance than standard rotor craft. Advanced helicopters like the Sikorsky X-2 and Boeing's Defiant utilize the compound rotor system. These helicopters are designed for higher speeds and longer ranges, making them suitable for military operations, search and rescue missions, and law enforcement tasks, where rapid response and extended operational capabilities are essential. <laughs> Lastly, Notor System replaces the traditional tail rotor with a duct fan and directional airflow. To counter the torque from the main rotor, it works by pushing air through the tail boom and out through side vents, creating thrust that stabilizes the helicopter. This design reduces noise, boosts safety, and cuts down on maintenance. This rotors, found in helicopters like the MD520N and MD902 Explorer, without an exposed tail rotor, it lowers the risk of rotor strikes, making it safer for operations in tight spaces. Its quieter performance is ideal for missions, where low noise is needed, such as urban air operations, police work, and medical evacuations. Helicopters are designed for various purposes, including military operations, rescue missions, and civilian transport. Each type of helicopter is tailored to meet specific needs, offering speed and utility that suit its intended use. With advancements in technology, helicopters are becoming more efficient, quieter, and faster. What's your favorite helicopter and which technology do you think suits it best? Thanks for watching. Please share your thoughts in the comment section. Introducing Jetline Marvel's first ever aircraft encyclopedia, a must have for aviation enthusiasts. Dive into a world filled with stunning images and fascinating details about the most iconic commercial and fighter aircraft. Explore the skies from the comfort of your home with this exciting collection. Now available on Amazon.